Hey everyone, I'm Steve from GamersNexus.net and we're here at CES 2016 with this video talking about the new Intel prototype for portable virtual reality, specifically the HTC Vive, and that is done by way of backpack, so it's new technology. All of this CES 2016 content is brought to you by iBuyPower's Revolt 2 gaming PC, a small form factor PC. Back to the Intel stuff, the backpack, we've got some B-roll and photos of it. It's actually just a complete prototype. You can see the tape holding it all together, standard duct tape, engineering principle. But the idea is to fully remove the VR from a remote system or from your usual desktop. And that is done by mounting a laptop to the backpack, in this case, an MSI GT72, probably a Dominator series laptop with a 980M. And that is then connected to the, the VR solution as usual through USB and HDMI cabling. The battery, there's gotta be a battery to power all of this obviously. The laptops only last about an hour in our testing for normal gameplay use. So to run this thing, it uses a 300 watt battery that is mounted to the backpack and the battery plus the laptop does make it a bit heavy, probably in the 20 to 30 pound range. We didn't really measure it or weigh it, but it's a bit heavy. So, you know, maybe some endurance issues or concerns, but it's a prototype. The backpack ultimately allows two main things in terms of use cases, and one of them is the ability to wander around a larger space. So with these lighthouses, the IR scanners that are used for the HTC Vive, you can actually deploy multiple of them. It doesn't have to be just two. And that allows you to expand the environment to larger rooms if you have a mansion or are a location-based entertainment solution. And in those scenarios, wearing a backpack will allow you to track farther from, well, really, you could go anywhere because you're not tethered to a system where you have a cord limitation and HDMI, uh, cable degradation, stuff like that. So that is one major use case. The other one is pretty simply that the tether is no longer in the way of your natural movement when you're turning around, rotating, pivoting, which are things where if you use the Vive or any other VR solution, you'll feel that cable kind of get stuck. Every time we've done a demo, we've done it with some kind of presenter there to help us and they always will stop us for cable management and that is something that this will help avoid so that's the intel prototype backpack not a whole lot out there in terms of if it's going to come to market at all it's really just a prototype kind of engineering fun thing to see if it would work and it did work we've got some more information on this in the article in the description below check that out and i'll see you all next time